Welcome back to Enslaved Odyssey to the West. So we just learned that her name is Trip and my name is Monkey. a fuel source. Fuel cell? No. This is from the old days. It's in that container. Looks like it's petroleum. You know, Monkey, if you could actually get up to that turret, you can take control of it. I can control turrets? What, like hack them, or...? I mean, hacking is more trips thing. Or maybe I just, like, <laughs> physically grab the turret and aim it in the direction I want. Yeah, I just wreck the thing and then, and then sit on it. Okay. So I think the thing's totally broken, so it shouldn't attack me again, right? I don't think so. Now I know I came up from this direction, can I not go down? Ah, this is the way we're going. Hey, 
Hey, wait up. I've got an idea. I think I can upgrade your equipment. <gasps> Is this gonna use the things I just got? All these weird red magic bucks? Oh, I bet it is. Okay, shield, combat, health. Let's look at shield. Costs 15,000. It's got to be using those those things, yeah. Okay, cool. Well, let's go through this then. Let's take a look. So shield recharge. This is the time it takes shield to recharge. Increases the number of shots monkey's shield can withstand. Increases the number of strikes monkey can block before taking damage. Okay, yeah, because when you block damage... Using your shield, um, that takes shield energy just the same as your shield takes energy when you get shot at. It seems like, like, I don't know if blocking shots is more efficient and takes up less shield energy, because I know that the shield automatically gets used if you're taking remote gunfire, you know, some sort of bullet or something like that. It just automatically uses your shield whether you have it up or not. But if you're getting hit by melee attacks, you have to have the shield up for the shield to actually be absorbing the attacks. So not exactly sure how that works out. Combat. Ooh. Oh, these are a lot more expensive. Staggered duration of enemies hit by the white attack. That'd be good. I use that quite a bit. Increases the charge of electricity on the stun charge attack to affect multiple enemies. Ooh, that would be good too. Okay, let me... I'm gonna go through all of these and I'll be right back and pick the ones I want. Okay, I think I know what I want. Uh, so in combat, there's one skill at the bottom, combat awareness. It is extremely cheap. It's only 5,000. Just gives you some info about enemy states on the HUD. So definitely want that. Um, attacking enemies glow red. Blocking enemies blue. Vulnerable enemies yellow. Okay, cool. So that should be super helpful. Um, also in health, you can actually make your health regenerate. So you can, you can gain more max health and regeneration. Um, regen would be really good. It's kind of expensive though. For now, I'm gonna get more max health. 25% more health. Okay, cool. And then there's a lot of cool stuff in combat. Things that affect the flow of the fight, your ability to uh, to dodge and kind of do clever things. Not not necessarily damage increasing things, but stuff like this. Powerful counter attack that can change the flow of a new fight. Uh, evade behind an enemy and then attack them. Like, these sound really good. Yeah, I think it's these two I want the, the most. Counter attack or evade is the question. I can only get one. Um... Let's do counterattack. Press B the moment monkey successfully blocks an attack. Okay. Hmm. Hope it does bonus damage. So blocking an attack would just be when you have your shield up, I guess. Okay. And then most of the staff stuff seems to be... There's lots of things about its ability to shoot, it seems like. In fact, I think these actually all might be about the ability to shoot. It's like fire rate and ammo increase... Uh, there's the stun blast. I think that's the it's the thing that you charge up, right? I think that's the stun blast. Yeah. Uh, let's get something else too. Can we get shield strength? Yeah. Let's get one shield strength. Let's go. Okay. I'm definitely gonna go for the bonus things now that I know they are actually seriously important. Yes, yeah, so this would be the block. So press B when I successfully block an attack. Can you help me across? <laughs> that looks so uncomfortable. <laughs> Jesus Christ, monkey. Can I throw a trip down the hole? Just go for a piggyback ride.
This looks like a battle arena. Wait, there's living fish here? Oh, they're beautiful. Yeah. That doesn't make any sense. They should be dead. Makes perfect sense. The sunlight feeds the plants. The plants oxygenate the water. The small fish eat the algae. The big fish eat the small fish. It's a closed ecosystem. Just like my home. My father designed our community to work in exactly the same way so that we'd never have to leave the outer compound walls. We grow our own food, condense our own water, create our own energy. We have everything. Except the future. What do you mean? Well, I've seen it all before. Scattered tribes coming together under one visionary leader. It's never long before they attract the attention of the slavers, which obviously has already happened. It was just one slave ship. And they caught a handful of us. Think more won't follow. If these fish can survive for 200 years against all the odds, so can we. Two things. One, the poor fish! You freaking asshole robot. Secondly, I think this is a boss fight. Okay. Yeah, I can't block that. Oof. That did nothing. Can only damage the demolition mech in the head. Okay, I think I'm out of ammo now, right? Yep. Oof. Trying to dodge, but... Damn. Trying to get the dodge timing down like Dark Souls, but not working. Ooh, more ammo. His systems are overloading. He's he's losing control. Was it in control before? Taunt it and make a charge. Okay. Hey! Oh, I gotta make him enraged and then distract him. Okay. No! way there. Oh, yeah, I'm almost dead. Okay, is there anything I want to make them charge in particular? Um, I guess the statue in the center, maybe the, the huge ball will fall on them and kill them? That's my guess. Wow, I'm so close to dead. Hey! 
There we go. It's working. Do it again. Ah. Ooh. Okay, well, at least we get our health back. <laughs> it should make it a lot easier now that I know what I'm doing. trying to like dodge like go in between his legs which works sometimes but it's a little bit tricky Fast. Scan this thing. <laughs> Where's the crash site now? Over there. We're getting closer. Gonna have to cross this ravine? Damn. You see that metal tower? Maybe we can use it to get across. Okay. I'll use the dragonfly to find us a route. I'll put a marker up on your headband display. We can get through here, but there are mechs up ahead. Looks like we don't have any choice. I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. Hurry up! So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to try to get to that metal tower. <laughs>